just that you were up so early. Have the police been in touch about the van? No, no, all good. Oh, not while he's on the job, Whit. The stiffs will get jealous. Oh, it don't hurt before you ask. Things got a bit rough with me and this bloke. Good with his fist. Still, gives me a bit of an edge. Everyone loves a bad boy. Wow. You really do get a kick out of screwing up people's lives, don't you? You know Callum could have been banged up because of you. I'm sorry about the van, but your uh, boyfriend's already given me a mouthful. Oh. I sorted it. OK, so we just forget about it then, yeah? He says he's sorted. No! I don't trust you. Where's our money? Oh, well, me and Callum have come to a little uh, agreement on that, haven't we, Cal? Uh, it's OK, babe. Fine. I'll see you later, then. Ooh. Someone got out on the wrong side of the bed this morning. Or maybe it was just the wrong bed. <laughs> Mrs Jacobs is ready. Uh, I'll uh, get Big Nigel to load her up. He's not really a morning person, is he? Not a stolen car person. What does it matter with you, eh? Doing it on your own doorstep. You promised me no dodgy motors. Don't worry. I've got rid of them. Yeah, good. And leave Callum out of it, all right? He's a good bloke. A bit too intense for me. I don't really do broody. 